March 11, 2011. It became an unforgettable day in the history of modern Japan. An earthquake of 9.0 magnitude hit Japan, centering on its northeastern Pacific coast. It was followed by a series of gigantic tsunami waves that swept the coastline. で、While there are still many issues to be solved, they are, little by little, moving ahead towards restoration. The educational scene is gradually going back to normal as well. However, there is still one major problem. In Japan, where an academic year begins in April, students who aspire to continue to high schools and universities must take entrance examinations beforehand. But students in the devastated regions have lost everything to the tsunami. Their textbooks, books for reference, and even their school buildings. The transportation network is still shut down. And they live in temporary housing, which does not provide a satisfactory environment. Nevertheless, they cannot give up on their dreams of continuing education. Castalia, a mobile learning platform provider, has joined forces with KDDI, a mobile service provider, to launch the Ishinomaki project to provide students of the disaster-affected regions with learning opportunities by way of mobile devices. Castalia features lecture videos provided by Shinga Kukai, an educational corporation based in Nagano Prefecture, on iUniv, Castalia's social learning service and KDDI lends 100 tablet devices and provides a wireless communication environment to the students of the affected regions so that they can study from the lecture videos. We have developed a social learning platform for mobile use. Mainly, our featured contents are open educational content. But after this disaster, 311, we don't have the, any content for specific objective um, the examination for uh, high school and university. KDDI and Castalia have been able to get the information from the school and 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 the school. The people who are safe and safe and safe and safe communication is the right to KDDI and the government of KDDI. 今回子供たちの未来をつなぐコンテンツを届けるそれが通信企業の役目だと思って取り組みましたManpower may be able to provide education temporarily However, providing it steadily is a different question Moreover, in Japan, where entrance examinations serve as major gateways to social participation Inequality in advantages may arise between children who were and who were not affected by the disaster. And we aim to help overcome the disadvantage of the affected with the power of the web and wireless devices. A mobile educational environment provides tremendous convenience to the students who have limited mobility and access to the usage of facilities. Social learning realizes an ecosystem in which someone's learning experience supports others' learning process. This is an innovative new form of education that has a high scalability enabled by the web. We are determined to continue this project as well as to provide this service as a new form of support through mobile devices in the wake of major disasters in the future. 国難とも言えるこの事態に通信企業ができることはまだまだたくさんあると思っております。これからも人々に笑顔を届ける、そんなお手伝いをしていきたい、そのように思っております。We do not just produce system and service. We create new learning and education opportunity. This must be a big innovation for everyone in the world.